Hi guys, uh, Jimmy here with Akash Garage, uh, working on a 2013 Chevy Cruze. We have a leakage at the uh, multi-port right here for water cooling system. It's called a, a escape valve, I think it's called. Uh, it broke off the tip. I'm just gonna show you really quick the part who is new. brand new. $25 at the dealership. Again, part number is 1325 $25 at the dealership. I bought a pre-mix uh, coolant antifreeze to add it up. So what happened, basically guys, this part right here has a uh, has its way. So you see this flap right here? Basically goes into here. This part right here goes into that tip right and what happens is the tip broke off this part right here where the uh, rubber broke where the rubber seal is it broke and now we have it into one little tip so when you take this one apart don't be afraid yeah. right don't be afraid to go and dig for the uh, broken piece inside for this unit just be careful because this unit do have a limit inside there. You can see it's a tiny pinhole, more or less. A little more than a pinhole. So it doesn't go through all the way. No, Just to get this part right here, use a flat screwdriver or shake it and beat it a little bit. Okay? So easiest things to do. This clip, this clip right here. Take your needle nose pliers, pull it out. And then disassemble. Put the clamp right there and clamp it, run it over, reuse the clamp, okay? These holes right here is as simple as just pushing down because you see it has that uh, one way and it's going to uh, clamp and stay put. Just make sure that you don't lose the safety pin, okay? So really quick in here, we're just gonna... Let's try it again. Okay, there you go. Off it goes. Off right here for the safe. And into there. So, for the other way around, simple guys. Make sure that you guys put this ball first with, with the safety side on. Okay, just give it a little turn. Okay. It's supposed to go like so, tight. <coughs> All right. So before putting the uh, actual hose, <coughs> you're just gonna connect this one right here down there. And you're gonna hear a little clip. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. A little clip. And then the safety pin goes mm -hmm. right here about this height. Mm -hmm. You see two, and then just right there, there's two pins. You hear a little click. Going back here, we can do that last. Carry over, and then we're just gonna put it on the spout. Okay, sorry guys, for motion. Okay, let go. Yeah, so it's the limit right there. So check in, mounting it, boom. One important thing guys is to make sure that now you turn the car on and you start, turn your heater on, you turn your vehicle on, blast the heater on to max, and then fill up the expansion tank to these lines right here. One, two, three, four lines. So don't go past line three, okay? Because otherwise the expansion tank will blow. It'll crack. It won't blow, but it'll crack. Okay, so I'm gonna cut this video short right now, and what I try to do is I'll uh, uh, use some uh, brake cleaner to dry out the spot to make sure there's no leaking, and I'll do a second short video about this one. Okay, don't forget about it. You need your flat uh, pliers and your needle nose pliers to remove this pin right here okay and a good plier because the pressure of the cramp 
the clamp right here. Okay, fire away. You okay. want nothing? No, that's okay. I got my dad helping me also. engine has so again full blast heaters no full blast heater turn the light on the heater oh, turn the light okay just add up the fluid okay Again, so you add it up to just about a three quarter line. There we go. Don't overfill it the first time because you're going to need to fill it up more. Aside of that, just let the engine run for about five minutes, let all the air bubbles out, and then max blast for the heater so that way your heating system will start to also purge letting all the air out you will see that my car already, already lost one line when it's sucking one line level because it's losing so much coolant all right guys so happy driving 1.4 turbo ecotech engine 2013 chevy cruise uh, like it love it and uh, show it.